<laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. It is Sid and Nick. And today we have the It's My Hair Tag, which is basically a natural hair tag. And yep. You ready? Let's get into it. Alright. So the first question is, why did you start this journey? Okay, so I'll go. Um well when I started being natural, there was no such thing as a natural. I was in the 10th grade, so it was like 2008. Um, I was getting perms up until up until then from like the age of I want to say like five or six like I got my first perm super young but um, what made me stop getting perms I was just like wow my hair can get super straight without a perm so like why am I still getting perms it's burning my head and giving yeah. me scalp uh, giving me scabs yeah. Yeah. so I was like I'm gonna stop so I just stopped getting perms and I haven't got one ever since yeah yeah, literally the same story. And I was like, I see how because I, I only got a perm every August. Like I only got one perm once a year. Once a year, mm -hmm. so I didn't even need them clearly, yeah. and that was a waste of fifty, sixty dollars that could have went to absolutely my high school air fossil shopping spree. Because <laughs> I love to pop some collars. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so number two is how long have you been on your journey? So mine just made nine years, so next Whoa. year it'll be ten. Whoa. Yeah, it'll be ten years. So I'm kinda like trying to think of something crazy I should do. Like, I don't know if I should cut my hair. I don't think that I would be brave enough to do that, but the idea of it is so cool to me. And it's something big, like the tenth year of being natural. I wanna do something fun, but I don't know, maybe I'll do like a crazy color or maybe I'll do like a cute cut. Yeah. I don't know. But yeah, it'll be ten years next. January. Oh, That's so long. Yes. I think I'm at seven. 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 Mm, That's still good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Seven. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So, are you natural, relaxed, or transitioning? Natural. <laughs> all the way. Natural. But Literally. when I did start going natural, I did it. I transitioned. I transitioned. Mm -hmm. We. I didn't do the chop or anything. Mm -hmm. I just. I just let it grow it out. out. Yeah, I just let the perm grow out. Okay. So number four is what is your current length? Current length is like bra strap. Yeah. Your hair yeah. is very, very It's long. like bra strap. Mm -hmm. Mine's like armpit length. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But she cut her hair all the time. So I, it, it could be. I just cut my strap. hair two weeks ago. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. Wow. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> what is your goal length? Goal length. Waistline straight, yeah. Curly, like bra strap. Bra strap, true. Mm -hmm. Same, yeah. Same, <laughs> same. <laughs> okay, what is your hair texture? Hmm. I think mine is like. I'm not really, really. I'm not a. I'm not like te high technical hair. on it, so yeah. I don't know. Maybe y'all can tell us, but it's like really it's kinky yeah i think you're like kinky curly it's super kinky you're like kinky i have to curly. manipulate my curl so much to get it mm -hmm. to this length because when it's wet it's like maybe right here yeah. so i have to manipulate it a lot so it's super kinky curly yeah mm -hmm. you're definitely kinky curly yes what about okay. you i don't know oh you don't know okay <laughs> <laughs> i literally do not know i don't know um length or health health, health? Both, but I feel like with health, then you'll get the length. Then you'll get the length. Yeah. Yeah. Like, so both. Mm hmm. Yeah. But health, health overall is definitely is more number one. Absolutely. Yeah. Like, your hair, can, scraggly your hair can be this short, but it can be so much more healthier than somebody that got hair you down your back. scraggly, raggedy, crunchy ends off your hair. Because, honey, probably half of the hair that she has is split ends. Mm hmm. So I would say health for sure. If you could only live with one hair product, what would it be? Ooh. Deep conditioner. It's life. It's yeah, life. A, a deep mask. Because mm -hmm. I mask your life. Like, I have, like, ten masks. Yeah. I yeah. love deep conditioning hair mask. Yeah. And that'll give you health, which also gives you men. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. What is your, um, I don't think this is on the paper, but, like, what is your um, favorite natural brand or product? Brand is probably Cantu and Trim mm -hmm. Moisture. Okay. Because people sleep on Cantu. Yeah, they do. It's really good. And it's like, 
it's more affordable than Shea Moisture, but mm -hmm. Shea Moisture is also very much made and popping. Absolutely, Shea Moisture will probably be mine. But when you Absolutely. in a penny crunch, yeah, that can too will come can right on through for you. I've used a couple of their products, mm -hmm. and I didn't really didn't do too much for what? my hair. Yeah, my hair likes it. Yeah, mm -hmm. I love it's Shea so Moisture. Good. Okay, what is the worst product you ever used? A perm. Yeah, a perm. <laughs> a perm. But a natural product would probably be. I hate to say it, but probably can too. Probably can too. I don't think that I'm I can think of like a hair. really bad natural hair product yet. Yeah. Because I'm Ooh. not like a product junkie. Yeah, I am. And I stick to what I know. Yeah. Or I stick to like stuff in the same brand. So mm -hmm. I know, like, okay, can too works. Keep going, can too. Mm -hmm. Shea Moisture works. Keep going with that. I ain't really like a branch off and yeah. try different. Mm -hmm. See me, I'll be like, oh, look at this. This is new. Let mm -hmm. me try it. Well, before I buy it, I'll YouTube it first. Then I'll purchase That's it. But yeah. That's a must. All right. So, go-to hairstyle. Um, probably be my little braid out. Mm -hmm. What I got going on right now, I will do a braid out. I'm the quickly. braid out queen. Quickly. Quickly. I'm a braid out queen. Mm -hmm. I love braid outs. Yep. My hair loves braid outs. Absolutely. My second would probably be like my low military bun. I call it my low military bun. And I do my second lot. would be my high bun. Yeah. She does a low bun, I do a high bun. Absolutely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Are you a product junkie? Absolutely. <laughs> Favorite oil? Hmm. 
Probably have to be coconut or olive. Coconut, olive, and castor oil. Mm -hmm. Not that I need castor oil. Yeah. But I feel like it's a really good repairable. oil. It is. Yeah, it's castor super, oil is really good. potent. It's mm -hmm. very potent. How long does your wash day take? It doesn't take long at all. Now that, <laughs> now that I'm like, I'm just like, oh, okay. Let me just slap something in there. Because a lot of times I don't shampoo my hair. I'll just put conditioner in it, no, co-wash it, and no, go about my day, detangle, do my breakout. Oh, no, ma'am. doesn't take long at all. How about no, you? Hours. Ooh. Because I have to pre-poo, and I have to shampoo, uh -huh. then I have to condition, then mm -hmm. I have to detangle, then I have to deep condition, and then yeah. I have to style. Yeah. So we're looking at a full Sunday. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That mm -hmm. Sundays are hair days. Yeah. It has to be. Yeah, it, it Cause is. Cause I need that full day. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I need the Me whole total, day. Me in total, I would say maybe three hours. Realistically about five. Yeah, I would yeah. say three. Because I like the pre-poo and the deep conditioner to really like- Penetrate. Sit in there. I'm yeah. sitting under the dryer with it. True. Like, I need it. I need that moisture. Worst thing to happen to your hair? A perm. It's gonna be a perm. Anything that's worse or negative or bad, it's yeah. gonna be a perm. Yeah. Because I should not have done that. Bruh. Like perms can perm. Bruh. Perms. Perms. They are putting chemicals directly onto your scalp. Yes, like that is above your brain. They can take rust off. They can do all kinds Bruh. of crazy stuff. Like perms are just no terrible. I mean, I know natural being natural and you know embracing natural hair is for everybody but perms y'all just look at who what no they're putting the in your crack. hair like yeah just say no to the cream and crack no. bro but underneath perm heat damage because yeah. you can have a head full of natural hair bro and you strain your hair one, one time, time. Mm -hmm. one time hey, bro only take one time one time only take one time <laughs> it is over. Yeah, you don't have to repair that. You got to put in extra work. And basically, you just gonna have to cut it. Yeah. Sometimes it'll be like sometimes a little wonky and it'll be a little wavy. It'll be a little limp. Yeah. But bro, when it's straight, just cut it. Mm -hmm. Just save your help. Save yeah, yourself the hassle. Oh yeah, all of that. You gonna have to let it go. You just gonna have to just do. cut it, bro. It'll grow back. It quick, quick, quick. All right. And the last question is, do you dye your hair? Yes. Clearly. We both have color in it. Mm -hmm. I did mine myself. Did you do yours just there? Not this one. Yeah. But my hair was, all the color on the bottom was my whole hair. So this is like all grown out. Mm -hmm. But I think after it grows out completely, I'm going to leave it my natural dark for a little while. That's what I was thinking too. I was even thinking like just going to get a box dye and just coloring my hair all back black. But yeah. I don't know because color is so fun. It's so and fun. then spring and summer is about to come yeah. on. You just want to be like, <laughs> But um, that's what you want to be like. On the beach. <laughs> <laughs> but oh yes, my gosh. we both have color and we love it. We love it. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's it. All right, guys, that concludes our It's My Hair Tag. So we will see you guys in our next video. Bye. Bye.